YouTube, YouTube, check this out. Y'all niggas believe this, bro. I just got off the turnpike. I just came way from Mariana, Florida. Eight hours away. Just got here. My wife looking at me all crazy, like, man, tell my son, uh, that's crazy. So I had to jump in the car, get the fishing poles. We going up, we on our way to 10 Miami Trail. I gotta go out there and smash her up real quick, then bring her home, you know? Cause she missed me. Well, you been gone for days. He been gone for days. Yeah, like he don't miss me. I miss you. I'm crazy about you, girl. I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Pops over you. So I'm gonna take you out here real quick, beat her down out here on this fish lake real quick. Show her who the man. I got you, shorty. It's going down. Y'all, y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna get me some coffee, and it's on from there. It's on. They go up with some ice in them. The ice keep them cool. It was ice got oxygen come out the ice. Mama Joe. Go country, baby. Oh, you found your boots up there? Yeah, I got three pair of boots up there. I ain't know about. I'm going country. Y'all wait, y'all wait till we move to Mariana. I'm gonna be country for real. I'm gonna have my cowboy head on. I'm gonna be like, come here, you little filly. The gambling hall, Southwest 8th Street, and Northwest 177th Avenue. We out here, baby. We finna go into the Everglades, do some fishing with some largemouth and some big brims. I hope I can hit me a beta wallmouth. Y'all know what wallmouth is? They look like bluegills, but they not. See y'all guys real soon. Down there, y'all. It's the babies down there. I mean, the mama's down there. 
The mama, they probably orphans. I got you set up. I put a bob on here. You're gonna put a shine on here, it's gonna throw it out. Wait for something to suck that bob up on the water, baby. I want you to get it, all right? Sure will. Yeah. Good, good. Big boys, yeah. Good. Come on, babe. Scared to put my hand in there. Gotta bake them shiny heels. Hooking them through the eyes. Just like that, they, they let them swim. You see the lady pads out there, right? So you got all you go throw in front of them orange balls, let it just go, all right? Y'all see her little boots? That's the only reason she wanna go fishing today, the way her boots, okay? We get the shine in the water before he die, at least. Why are you throwing the lady pads? No, I ain't no, no, what? Not today. Not today. You got to be careful fishing out to this joint. Serious. It's a busy highway. Gotta know what you're doing crossing these creeks. No fishing from bridge. Okay, I can read. Man, it's hot here on the trail. I tell you, but I'm sure trying. It ain't because we ain't trying. I'm sure at it. Hey, they just won't bite. You can't make them bite. We showed out here, man. Thank God for that little bit of breeze just blowing. Ooh, that feel good. But I got on this rod here, my bait caster. See, I got that black curly tail worm. That used to do pretty good out here, man. They look a black little moccasin coming across. This rod here, I got uh, a live shining down there running under, under that bridge. Let me see, let me see what happened. Y'all hold on. You too, you too. I think she come to fishing just to eat her lunch. What you are? Huh? No, I'm, I'm a man. What that mean, what you are? I, 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 I ate mass before I left out the parking lot, good. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take you to a little special little spot around this corner on Loop Road. You ever been on the trail, you know about this here, man. But this place here have really helped save my life when we was kids. Cause my dad was bring us out here every day. And back when we was coming out here as kids, man, back in the 70s, Loop Road, back in the 70s, the Indians, they had like scrawl, they had scrawl tents. They literally had scrawl tents and stuff out here. Now they got beautiful homes. They stay free. They don't pay no taxes. They can build their house out here on the, on, the, on the land. And look at these houses, man. They got some spectacular houses out here, man. Really good. Hey, they ain't sleeping on no tents no more, no scrawl houses no more. They didn't came up. They go, a couple of them still living the old fashioned ways. They got their little scrawl huts. That's how they used to live before. But now these people out here, they got beautiful homes out here built with concrete. Stuck home. Look at that nice cars in the driveway. You got a couple of them refused to change from the old ways. But this is the place, man. This saved our life. We was kids. We used to be out here playing. See there? Now they refused to change. They still got the old fashioned way up under the tent. But lots of them build homes out here, man. Beautiful homes. Look. But out here, we used to come out here hunting and fishing. That one there never survived a hurricane. But we used to come out here and do lots of rabbit hunting, fishing. Man, we spent all our Saturdays out here. It's what kept us out of trouble. We, we grew up in the projects. Some of the worst projects in Miami, man. Look at that one, that's nice. And man, we had a rough. So my daddy get us out of, get us, keep us out of trouble on the weekend, bring us out here on Saturdays. We'd be out here all day long, fishing and hunting for rabbits and running around and catching snakes and catching big bass. And you can see across the street over here, this is a big old little river. All the way down, but swamp land all the way back there, man. Go back there, some nice big deep ponds, four or five feet deep ponds, full of bass. Back it up, maybe about maybe about a half a mile back there. You got to hike back there and do all that stuff. But I haven't been in a long time. But you guys stay tuned. Show you some good stuff. You know what? This is crazy. Go back. I, I can't see. Two Like the safety is place is to go the opposite way. Down the Everglades, where they 
it rain, everything flood out. See how deep it is and better than my pickup truck. Not we'd be in trouble, man. It's a little low area. You know, we'll get the water coming from the east side of the canals. They built this road in the middle. I'm surprised we didn't see a python yet. So the water's so high, they usually be up and come up in the road. Because the water be so hot there. So they come in the road to try to survive, stay dry, the sun out. I'm surprised we you seen one? I'm surprised we, I'm, I'm surprised we haven't seen one yet. I do. They ain't got a spot right now. They ain't got a spot. Got a spot further down. Don't worry, Shorty, I got you. I know how to swim like Tarzan. I swim What you gonna do? I swim you out here. I'll be like, I grab you, swim you up out of here. You be like, what? I'll be like, ooh, 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 swim you out of here. With your shoulders. Oh, yeah, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but I ain't swimming, girl, I save you. We going deep, babe. This place right here, Loop Road Educational Center. They, they get they do a good thing on Saturdays for kids. They have hogs, eagles, wounded animals that they bring here, bring you know to uh, patch them up. But this is where they roll in and turn into a dirt road. That once you get past this part here, it's gonna tell them what you gonna see. And you gotta remember, we like an hour and a half away from the closest hospital. So whatever happens to you out here, you like on your own. But I got an alligator hole back here that I should go to and get some gator meat every now and then. I wanna see Vegas. I ain't been back here in years, so I wanna go see do they do they still hang up pain back here. So we're gonna see in a little while. Let's see what's gonna happen, y'all. Got a bite, babe? Ain't got nothing. Fishing in the hood, fishing in the hood. This used to be one of my favorite spots right here, man. Y'all see this water down here, you won't believe it, man. Beautiful. Lots of rock. It used to be full of gators. I don't see I don't see a gator down here today. That's weird. Dangerous. He's got gators everywhere around him. He play with it if he want them. Look at that junk. Got a nice current. I got a live shiner running. Something pick up on his tail. See him out there. That's what. That's called a, a thingamajig. You know what it's called? <laughs> Little bluegill. Look, look, look. I know he's gonna come out sooner or later. Look at that big old gator. Now he ain't no big one. He about what six feet. Oh, you we in a little gator hole. Catch a little, we catch bluegills about the size of your little half of your hand. Hook them through the top of the head so you can snatch them off real quick. And so, this is how you gator fish. Watch this. He's scared. Back to this over here. Okay, I gotta get another rod. When I was telling you about the gator, right? Let me show you something. That's why I hooked the brim on top of the head. See that? All he do is snatch the brim off. We don't hurt the gator. It's just fun hooking them. It's just for fun. We ain't hurting them. I got my hook back. He okay. Look at that. He out there feeding again. You guys stay tuned. Fishing in the hood. sound anything hit that water but look at he has hit the leaves he hit and everything now next look at this one over here he kind of creep up my hand sneak back you. little sneaky rascal you okay, cool. get a close up get a close up look how he's submerged look at that he looks just like the rocks down there right look at that look just like the rocks 
I'm going over different. Look at another one. There go another one came. Look at another one coming. They gonna come out. Look at that. another one coming through the drain. Damn. I told you they everywhere around here. I've been coming in since I was a kid, man. We used to come in and have a field day on Davis. Watch. Oh, you know what? See, they coming up, they coming up from everywhere. I'm just get ready to jump in the truck, babe. When I tell you to jump in the truck, jump. See him growling? Yeah. Where you going? You ain't got to tell me. <laughs> Look at this one, baby. Look at, this, look at that big one coming from under the hole. He got a lure in his mouth. Look at that red and white lure in his mouth. That ain't all you lure, because we don't use that color. No, he just came from the other side. That's what's making them noise in the bushes over there. Now watch, they're going to start running across the road. See over there? They're going to start coming out the bushes everywhere. That's why I'm in the truck. I know how this goes, so I know I'm getting ready to run. But Let me put my feet up, y'all. Look at another one coming from down there. I'm telling you, watch. I'm going to have about 15 here in a little while. Y'all stay tuned. Now we got seven. They think it's a feeding frenzy going on. Look at that little baby one. That's it. Watch a little baby one get caught up over here. They're going to wind up eating him in hell. Ha, ha, ha. Babe. Hey, you got to make him come. They think he's going to fall in the water. So they think, they, look at that. They think I'm going to fall. They're going to really crazy. Babe. Whoa. See, that's what you get. You know what? It's only in South Florida. You guys want to come to this place? What you need to do? Oh, that's a get out in the truck, man. What you need to do? That's a tie. What you hey. <laughs> Come all the way down Southwest 8th Street. Going west. Just keep coming down south to get the loop road by that Baptist church I showed you. And man, you will have a good time. Bring your kids out here. They'll enjoy it. Look at that. That's, that's why I tell you, you got to hook the fish on top of the head where the, where the gator really won't get hurt. Look, I got my hook back. Yes, we really, I'm just really messing with them. Man, I've been doing this since I was a kid. For me, me a crocodile hunter, you know. This one right here, you know, crocodiles could jump up five feet. Yep. You seen them climb through fences? Fishing over for me. Now, I know I might not be catching no fish today, but I'm having fun. This what part of fishing. So you just get the get you just barely hook it on top of the hay. So when he when he get the fish, they watch him. Make sure he don't jump up here. He just standing. They right here. smart because they going up under so they can come across the other side. Look at this one. See him sit right there. You gonna see him? I see come him. right here. I, nope. Why are you gonna see him? I'm crazy. Ain't no fish biting, but Gator's so biting. Oh. Man, he want me so bad, his mouth from He like, he trembling. Like, off his fat tail falling here, I knocked them overalls off of him. Look at him. Look how he submerged. So what quick. about the, the fish that's over there? He gone? I ain't got time for him. No, I'm pretty sure he gone. Everything, that's why all the fish out here gone. Look, they started popping up from everywhere. Take a ride on your back. Look at, the, look at the lure in his mouth. He just swallowed. He just bit somebody lure earlier. <laughs> I'm making a lot on his back. 
The other one gonna try to bite my back while he gonna try to jump. I can tell you. See that? I told you. Didn't I just tell you that? He gonna try to jump. He'll jump. He'll jump. See? You gotta be highly trained to do this. Like, I, I got training in the projects. <laughs> Whoa! They gonna get mad after a while. They already mad, man. Look at that. Two more than came. Look at the two more down there coming. But look at this big one right here with his head right there. Look at the little one trying to sneak up on me. See him right there? Look at him. He's sneaking up on me from back there. Why are you over here? Because I got to jump in the car though. <laughs> hey, this is how you catch alligators in Miami. Got him though. I sure got him. Well, he got me. He got me fish. Yeah. Alligator fishing is tiresome. I'm going to go snook right now. You want to catch one? <laughs> no, seriously. They're going to pop the line, but I'll, I just catch it for the fight. Watch. He's, he's gonna pop it, but just to, just to say you caught a gator. <laughs> <laughs> I, I used to talk 100 bucks for this, but I'm gonna show gas up it for free. Today. <laughs> I lost it already. <laughs> <laughs> just swallowed it. No, nah, it's like the, I, I got the hook belly. It's a bit. This is it's, it popped it. Belly holding it. It popped it. Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah, he took it already. <laughs> yeah, he took it already. It's a belly looks small, baby. It don't hurt. So now you can say you hooked the gator. Yeah, I hooked the gator. <laughs> know what? Know what? Know what? Know what? 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 You too. You too. Let me ask y'all this something, man. Help me out, gentlemen. Now, when you like, you know ain't that much in the cup to drink. Then you try to be nice. You take your little sip. It ain't that much. Take, Why? Take a little it ain't that much. Why? Because you drink it all. You tell your wife to get a swallow, and she drank the whole, all the good part. First of all, you put my water in your cup. But it was my frozen cup, that the sweet part. But it's my water. Kim, listen. But gentlemen, so y'all both of that, just like, huh? You want a little sip? And cause y'all sip on it, cause it's hot out here and sipping in that much now. First of all, it was my water that he put Second in. Second of all, it's my cup. It's my Yeti cup. And it's my ice pops in here. Okay? Oh, your ice pops frozen. My water was made it liquidy. But the question is, do your wife do that to you? Drink all your stuff? Yeah, you drank it all before you even gave it to me. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, how y'all doing? Fishing in the hood, man. We had an interesting day today. Y'all see this right here? B-R-I-N-S-O-N. Man, we been spray painting this one years ago. We used to come up here and fish all day long, man, catch some of the biggest bluegills. Oh, they got big, look at that big shed cracker. Big bluegills and stump noggles and y'all know about wall miles? But this is where we used to come in and catch all kind of stuff. Man, the Everglades have changed so much. The irrigation's so different now. They got salt water coming into it. It's just a mess. And they keep cutting down everything. 
so you keep everything spooked around this joint. Hey, but we, hey, but thank you guys for viewing in today, man. We we enjoy you, and remember, man, we can't do this without you. Hit the bell, give us a thumbs up, send me some comments. Hey, with the gator fishing today, it was just all fun. We got, I still got my hook on my line, small hook. That's hooking the fish on top of the head, ain't hurting the gators. Just aggravate him a little bit, but he'll be all right. He already, he already got, he already got a terrible temple. Hey, but we love you guys, man. Y'all remember, pray for us. We'll pray for you, and you watch God work things out. Love you.